23 of my colleagues trying to win the nomination that I won were saying that Biden wanted to allow people to have private insurance still. They can. They do. They will. Man, does a person's voice have an impact on how they're perceived. They can be saying the exact same things, and by using the proper tonality, it conveys something completely different. In this video, we're gonna break down Biden and Trump's speaking styles, and I'm gonna categorize them from a very clinical perspective, and then we're gonna talk about how the different tonalities impact the perception from voters and people watching the debates. And we increase it. We do not wipe any, and one of the big debates we had with 23, of my colleagues trying to win the nomination that I won were saying that Biden wanted to allow people to have private insurance still. They can. They do. They will. And well, he hadn't drawn a line. He still, for example, makes sure that we, he wants to make sure that methane's not a problem. We can, you, you can now emit more methane without it being a problem. Methane. Right. This is a guy who says that you don't have to have mileage standards for automobiles that exist now. This is a guy who says that. Okay, this is a classic version of supplicative tonality. His voice not only ends in an upward fluctuation, how are you today? We are gonna do that, my plan does have that, but also just an elevated tone. So the whole thing is almost like you're singing. So you hear me talking now, and if I were to raise it, and you hear me talking now, the whole thing is shifted up, and then it ends with even a higher upward tone crescendo. What does that communicate? Well, there's three different types of tonality, supplicative, neutral, and rapport breaking. Supplicative is the way that people speak to people that they believe have higher status than them. So someone who's working for someone else talking to their boss, hey, what time do I need those reports in today? Hey, hey, how are you today? And how does the boss sound when he talks back to him? I'm fine, have those reports in at three o'clock. And that conveys confidence. Notice yourself when you're talking to somebody, if you perceive them to have higher status than you, whether it's in the business and they just have situational authority over you or just someone that you think is really high status, notice how your tone shifts. Now let's listen to how Trump sounds. It, it, it's all true, and here's He's the deal. He's talking about the Green he, New Deal, and it's not two billion I'm, or 20 billion, as you said, I'm, it's $100 trillion. I'm, He's talking about the Green New Deal, and it's $100 trillion. It's rapport breaking teetering on some neutral tonality, and that is where you want to reside. Listen to confident speakers. Listen to leaders around the world. Almost all of them, except for maybe Justin Trudeau, speak in a confident way because it indicates your confidence. Confidence is hard to fake. So regardless whose side you're on, take a step back from your political beliefs. Maybe you think Trump is being a bully. Maybe you think he's overbearing. Maybe you think Biden is being more presidential. Take all of that out. If you were to just listen to these guys speaking and you had no bias about the politics, Trump comes across as more of a leader simply because he sounds more confident. He sounds like he believes in what he's saying. And as a leader, that's very important to sound like you believe what you're saying and actually believe what you're saying. I wanna keep this video quick, but I've got another video where I go deep into the three different types of tonality and I'll teach you a little bit more how you can speak with a more commanding and confident voice. It's because a lot of times when people, when, you, when, when they talk, what, what people just kind of lose interest, they turn away, Versus if people are drawn in and they immediately, maybe they don't know you, but they perceive you as having high status simply by listening to your voice. It's a very powerful thing to have. So you can touch or click right here and I'll walk you. My voice just a few years ago, I keep all my old YouTube videos up. Take a look at the way I sounded just a couple years ago before I learned this stuff. Hello, today I wanna to talk to you about what may be the most important